All right, fuckers. Sorry for what is probably really crappy video quality, but we ain't closing blue stack this time. Let's just, uh, honestly play this during lunch again, because I have no idea. We're not having blocks this week, nothing to prepare for. Uh, we ain't doing the fucking usual lit Wednesday, Thursday episodes. Might still be feature length Friday litness, but I don't know, mate. Definitely know my immortal reading this week. Uh, if I don't finish my immortal by the end of the school year, I might just make some videos at home of it, reading the rest of it. Um, over spring break, you can be expecting a uh, Spanish video since Posi Nando from Skybite did so well, apparently. I don't know. I don't know, why do you guys watch that shit off? Why did dabbing it up to go viral then? I'm not okay with that, that was from a dark- That was from a dark time in my life, and it's like, it's just making me want to cry that people are just bring it back again. Like, it's been rediscovered. <laughs> yeah, everyone is just coming up to me and just quoting dabbing it up to I'm just like, <laughs> Why do you do this? <laughs> Good God. Anyways, ah! don't you make fucking worry. I'm just gonna be sitting quietly over the whole time playing fucking Plants vs. Zombies Heroes. Ah, this is not gonna be a good episode, okay? Rank 35, higher than I've ever been before. How oh, Jesus fucking Christ. I just fucking annihilated my arm. I am in immense pain. Okay, that's beside the point. Oh boy! Ooh! Ooh, searching for an opponent. Oh yeah, that's my favorite. I love when it's searching for an opponent. There we go. Okay, so let's just get this out of the background. Um, facing an electric boogaloo, I think it was. Yeah, boy. Okay, this is a god awful starting hand. I'm gonna refresh all these. That's still pretty bad, actually. If I can get that twin sunflower down, things might go okay, Lee. Fuck. God damn it. They're gonna remove this, but... What? Don't ask me how that survives. That's not good. I guess Disco Zombie would be next, but okay. God damn you. Well, let's see where this goes. Come play accordingly. Alright, that's about that. So we're gonna take out this. Next turn, we can try to get rid of that, buddy. Nice. Mm. Real nice.
My dude, what the fuck? Colonel Corn! Nope. God damn it. Let me guess, Ponga? Yup. Nice turn, sour grapes. Let me have it. Top deck sour grapes. Give me that top deck sour grapes game. Top deck sour grapes. Come on, give it to me. If it's not top deck sour grapes, I might concede. I don't care about my speak, mate. I wanted. Season, you can do it. That's really good. That's why you play them on heights for things like that. That's probably deadly. Fair trade, getting rid of one of their smelly zombies is good. Zap in and then I'll sour grapes next turn.
Well, I ain't trusting that shit, mate. All right, it was a move. I was expecting surprise guard, but that works too. Let me guess, plus three. Yup. Now zap that and kill it and make them regret that decision immensely. Alright, that's fine. That's cool. Let's do that. Damn, I was hoping they would end up there and there. Uh... All right, sure. Okay, now it's, uh... Yeah, this is actually pretty good. I can just, um... Wipe out this. And do that to kill that. Boom. Okay then. Bye bye. <laughs> Give me very blast for lethal. Boom! Now that's what I call a top deck. Oh, they think they just saved themselves. Little do they know. Little do they know. Boom. God damn it. Seven times. Got him. All right, let's get Roy into the fucking fight. Ah! Oh boy, it's Professor Fuckboy. I do know I should say Professor Dickbags because. One, two, three, four is always nice to have. Not playing that turn. I only play Puff Stream turn one. Or Stream for two, you know what I mean. I should know what to say. I'd probably replace Puff Stream in this deck because it's not that great usually. It's really just uh, worse than Morning Glory in the case of this deck. Other than for, save for um, Petal Morphosis, I guess it's, it's pretty good. So, this is gonna bait something, or they're gonna take 4 damage to face, either way it's good. That's really the only reason this is in the deck, is so, because it's a decent 2 drop, and because it's great as bait. And because this is an RNG deck, so... It's only fitting. 
Ah! The Eureka the Squirrel Herder. Boy, what? Let's just do this, just to do this. And then, I guess, in case that's a Eureka Swashbuckler, okay. I'm fine with that. Save me from two damage to face, I guess. It's not the greatest sacrifice right there. Oh, boy. That's potentially ten damage to face right there if I get lucky with block rolls. Pretty much guaranteed 8 damage to face, which is pretty dang good. Let's we'll just get that down while we can, get a little bit of heal from it, take out their uh, gadget scientist. Um, I don't really care about the electrician yet, hasn't become a huge threat. Gonna get a bit of heal here. Ooh, another blue blueberry. Oh, that was a nice right there. That was like very nice. Oh, as they say. All right, all right. They're definitely gonna pull some. Tr they're gonna use chicken egg. No, they don't have chicken egg. They have bungee plumber, don't they? Oh no, wrath. Of course they have some about wrath. All right, fair enough. Uh, zap out that guy. Or that, that actually works too, that saves you. Uh, I don't know if it'll last another turn though. I might go for the 8 damage to face next turn. Oh wait, oh wait, yeah, definitely going for this this turn. Okay, so that's gonna be like, Electrician, um, what's its face, what's its face. Drone Engineer, you know. Okay, so I'm gonna basically have... Well, I was actually- did I actually call it in the right order? So I have lethal next turn. Yeah, next turn's lethal unless they pull some crazy shit here, which they can't, because that's- that's two drone engineers. Or two Kong zombies, but yeah, see, drone engineer- let me guess, drone engineer. Boom. Lethal next turn, strong berry, three damage, five- make that two more damage. If they block that, I can just do five damage more. So. Unless they get lightning bolt and kill strongberry, uh, that could be problematic. Okay, that took out that. Yeah, that that makes it lethal for sure. Doing that to face. All right, let's go for this, my dude. So now I say, how do I go about this? Actually, I might just go for strongberry sour grapes right now, just to get rid of this in case they do pull, get some lucky block shit. Yeah, yeah, we're going for sour grapes strongberry now, because I don't want to risk anything. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, I'm not risking that lethal, because if they got lightning bolt, they could stop it and then fuck me over. Next turn, though... I mean, I have potential lethal this turn, right now. If I don't proc the block meter, if I do proc the block meter, I have guaranteed lethal next turn. Well, that's guaranteed lethal. Would they have gotten lightning bolt? That's the question. They would have gotten summoning. Which, putting them saved. Oh, that's a really good thing to get from summoning. Oh my god. That's one of the better summoning drops. Wow. 
Too bad they won't get to use it at all. Alright, fair enough, doesn't matter. I don't know what you expected to happen to save you there. Maybe you had a chicken egg. That actually would have probably been it. They probably had a chicken egg. Boom, boy! Oh my god, people are replying! Boy. Oh god, that was gross. I don't care. What you want? Alright, that's a, that's a decent hand, I guess. Would like to have sour grapes against him, Kennedy, but... I I That's where I don't want to take four damage to face, right? At least not turn one. Uh if they play that again, turn two, I might play this. Boy, what the McFuck is you doing? I'm playing Flash for this bomb, it's Hero! What you want? <laughs> Alrighty! That's ideal. That means I can play that there for free. They can't counter that. Diamonds. Oh, that's a good thing to get from a seed. Like that's gonna be deadly. I'm gonna play this. See, that's them trading a 3-drop for essentially a 2-drop since that came from a seedling. I mean, it's the right move, but it's still... Still sacrificing a deadly. What you want? They're gonna counter that with deadly, aren't they? I don't think I'm gonna play this yet. <laughs> We're blasting this guy. Probably intended to like smoke bomb that next turn or something. Uh, I don't know actually why they played that at all. That was really not the greatest move on their behalf. Uh, give me sunburn. Yeah, I got sunburn. That jack o' lantern's getting a bit out of control. Uh. <laughs> We're gonna have to play some new powder or else they're done. They're done Uh, I'm just gonna play down this. Unless I play a headstone cover, which I might squash. <laughs> Alright, that's something. I'm gonna squash that. 
force them to take another four to face. And then after that, if they don't get lucky with blocks, that will be five to face next turn. And this thing's just gonna get out of hand. And basically, it's gonna be really hard to counter now. Unless they... No, they can't play Plank Walker yet. They definitely can. Even if they did, I can Sour Grapes it now. I can almost Strongberry Sour Grapes. It's going really well with this Jack-O-Lantern. Not gonna lie. Oh. Sorry, dudes, though. Not gonna happen. None of their tricks can stop this, none or kill it. Um, ooh, that's fire to face right there. If they don't get lucky with block, that's lethal next turn. I can play, uh, I can actually play Electric Blueberry and get a chance at guaranteed lethal, but I don't know if I'll do that. This is the best jack-o'-lantern I think I've ever had, actually. It's doing really well, just on its own, basically. Like, there's very little that is supporting it. Okay. I don't know what's going on there. I'm gonna block it with that. Hope that works out. I'm gonna do this. Alright, fair enough. Uh, I don't know. All zombies get deadly? Okay. So, I still have a chance at lethal here. I didn't get it. Rip. <laughs> they could come back from this, actually. I need a I need a sour grapes next turn, and then I can strongberry sour grapes. Oh yeah, I definitely need a sour grapes next turn. Give me that sour grapes next turn, yo. It's not sour grapes. That's actually pretty good, though. If I wipe that out... And then... That might be another swashbuckler. Either way, this is the right move, I think. Yup, that's another swashbuckler. Uh, if they have a chicken egg, I'm done. I'll concede if they have a chicken Yup, they have a chicken egg. GG. Nice comeback. You deserved that, actually. You didn't do any bullshit. I probably missed Lethal like seven times there, actually. That was a really good super stretch, actually. Like, getting things in like all the ground lanes and then doing that, especially against Solar Flare. Not a bad move. Okay, I'm gonna make a thumbnail now. Before I continue. What's the food gonna be? Um... Let's see. What do for this? Um, I don't know what I'm expecting here. I can do that. Uh, Chris Rice. What is Chris Rice? What the fuck is this? Curtis Price? What? Dude, that's actually great though. Let's just put that like on the side. Oh my god. The Chris Price is so large. And now we need to get Solar Flare. And then we need to get the, uh...
this. Oh my god, this is gonna be excellent. Um, oh my god, why is it so big? That's just like erase everything. Like, this is not a big enough eraser, is it? Okay. I don't know if I'll keep the hand or not. I definitely need to keep the message. So that's getting dangerously close to erasing the message. I don't want to erase the message at all. Oh, this is on the same layer. God damn it. Let's copy this and then control Z everything. New layer, control V. Back to erasing. Uh, let's see if we can get that more position, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see if I can, like, oh my god, yeah, this is gonna work. This is gonna work well. I was worried it wouldn't, but... That's, like, the idea right there, oh my god. All right, let's just, uh, close out at search. Did I ask for your opinion? Yeah, this is today's thumbnail. <laughs> Alright, let's end the mic frickin' recording! <laughs>